Good morning YouTube, this is CJ and I wanted to share with you a couple of journal pages that I just finished making from pieces of ephemera that uh, two of my swap partners over on Deconstructed Art Journals on Facebook had sent me. Uh, we have a group over there in which we can send each other little envelopes or packets of just, you know, a variety of inf uh, ephemera such as, you know, napkins and pieces cut out and doilies and words and, you know, things like that. And I, ha I really enjoy, once I've received one of those little packages, to see if I can make something from the contents. Now this isn't actually part of the swap, it's just something that I've been doing on my own where I'll take the different pieces and see what I can come up with. So anyway, this is a napkin that, let's see, I believe that was uh, Katina Pearson had sent me. And the reason I have it out here like this is I wanted to show you that here's one of the pieces, or well, pictures on there. And here's the other one. I thought this was just beautiful. What I did with this was I cut it apart and recreated, and I'll show that to you here in just a moment. So I'm going to set this up here. Here's the first one that I made. This is uh, the journal page that I'm going to put in uh, to my book. And basically she had sent as one long strip bits and pieces and I cut it apart and put it on here. This was a separate little frame and a separate picture and I put that together. And this was a doily and I kind of crunched up the end just because I wanted some dimension on there. And the base, this was just one large sheet that she would sent. And then when you open it up, this is that napkin I just got through showing you. Okay, you can see how I cut this apart. And I put this up here. I moved this down. I put a leaf in here that wasn't there before so that this is the way it did look and this is the way I put it onto the page. turned out super nice and then she had given me this trim on either side. Okay and then on the back she had this picture of glasses. This flower is another napkin. It was a napkin that had a large peacock on it and I like the flower I just wanted just the flower so I cut it out and put it on here and then this was a card like um, oh some of the cards you see like in Project Life that type of thing so this was the first one okay then the second one from her she had sent this piece of oh I guess it's wallpaper um, pieces and this is what the background is here it's it's quite heavy it's kind of almost like a reminds me a little bit of vinyl uh, and it's got an interesting texture to it um, this is a separate bottle this was a separate piece and uh, some words off of another card on the inside it was plain like this right here it was plain like this I added this card I love the color combination this butterfly was again from the napkin that had the peacock on it so I just cut it out separately this was a piece that is actually embossed I don't know if you can see that or not but it's in, embossed that she sent I thought that was very cute and I stuck this hat there with it and a little bling then this is tape. I don't know whether it's washi tape or, or what, but I thought that fit real well there. And then here's the back of it. I just added the word smiles and a couple of circles within each other. And I like the way this one went together. The hardest part was gluing anything to this paper. Uh, the paper itself is beautiful, but 
just your regular glue like an Elmer's it would not stick I had to get something a little bit stronger but it all held up went together very nice so there's a two of the uh, pages I was able to make from uh, Kathleen's uh, package that she sent me and then the second one was from Dorga Smith and this is the first one she had sent this blue background piece which I'm gonna guess was um, maybe a jelly print but I'm not sure but it turned out just beautiful on there and then she had pieces of paper that was this green and I immediately saw as soon as I saw that it reminded me of fish so I went ahead and cut those out these circles were actually lollipops uh, that were stickers this was another paper that was just a little square and I cut it into like the ground part of the water <coughs> excuse me and then this was just some papers that was sent okay that's the front and back there the inside this was it was like a tissue paper that she had sent and then this picture and another part of the tissue paper had this big butterfly on it so I put it behind her like a wing this is a button that she had sent and this was a separate flower and it went together real nice okay and then the second one from the darkest the background on this one is this pinkish paper and again I believe that's a jelly print a beautiful I love the way that went together okay here's the front and there's like three layers of papers here to create this flower there was this uh, toothpick with the words live laugh and love on it and then another button that she had made this was a separate piece where it says celebrate inside I added this piece where this blue flower is all the blue here like this that was a separate piece that was tissue and I added this that was tissue this flower the hearts these are all things that I added and it came together really super nice and then on the back this is a doily and then the yellowish area is actually from the envelope um, I use everything if there's something on there that uh, in fact like on this one this right here was tape that she had on the envelope and then this button so you can see this all went together just super super nice so I want to thank you again for your packages of ephemera and we'll talk to you again later have a great day and bye bye